Welcome to this video on the data security aspect of Tableau Server and Tableau Online. There are four main components of Tableau Server and Tableau Online security. Authentication, authorization and permissions, data security, and network security. This video focuses on the third piece, data security. Data security ensures that the appropriate data is seen by the appropriate people. For example, a doctor seeing only her patient's data or a sales manager seeing only information about his territory. There are a few ways data security can be implemented with Tableau Server or Tableau Online. This can be done solely in the database, solely in Tableau, or a hybrid approach where user information in Tableau Server or Tableau Online corresponds with data elements in the database. This video focuses on the latter two approaches. For more information on how Tableau leverages existing data security implemented solely in the database, please refer to the online help. Here we're connected to the global Superstore dataset. We have managers who should only see an individual market rather than the entire world. These managers are also users in my local Tableau server install. First, Implementing data security solely in the Tableau environment. This is done with user filters, which are defined in Tableau Desktop. To implement this data security, on the menu bar, click Server, then Create User Filter. We now see a list of available fields that we can base the user filter on. We'll choose Market. If we are not already signed in to Tableau Server or Tableau Online, we may be prompted to do so. Here are a list of the users on my server. Let's assign each user to their appropriate market. I'll only do a few. I'll also assign the administrator rights to view all. Once the user filter has been defined, we can simply drag it to the filter shelf. In the lower right corner of Tableau Desktop is a user emulator. This allows us to see what the view will look like if a specific user signs in. I'm currently signed in as the administrator, so I can see all markets. Let's toggle between some of the users. As we can see, as each user is selected, the view is filtered to show only their relevant market. If we publish to Tableau Server or Tableau Online, the same experience will carry through. When Chuck signs in, he'll only see the APAC region. The user filter can also be used across multiple worksheets or embedded into the data source. Let's embed in the data source. We'll remove the user filter currently on the filter shelf. Right-click on the data source. Choose Edit Data Source Filters. Add and select the filter we created. The filter now applies to everything using this data source. And if we publish the connection to data server, the user filter will be leveraged across all connections. For more information on data server, please see the on-demand video or the online help. The example we just walked through is implemented solely in Tableau, meaning the approach does not leverage any data elements in our database. We'll now look at an example of a hybrid approach. We're connected to Global Superstore again, but this time to both the orders and the people's table. The people's table is an example of having data elements in the database that associate users to specific pieces of data, like managers to markets. To create a user filter that leverages this data, we can use calculated fields. We'll right click, select Create Calculated Field, and we'll name this Manager Verification. We're going to leverage a user function. These allow us to use a variety of variables based on the Tableau server or Tableau online user, like their username or group they're a member of. We'll create a simple formula that checks if the Tableau username matches the manager field. Once this calculated field is created, we can use it in a similar fashion to the user filter in the previous example. It can be dragged to the filter shelf, let's do that, 
or applied to multiple worksheets or embedded as a data source filter. The benefit of this calculated field approach is that no maintenance has to be done to the workbook as new users or data are added to the system. As long as the users exist in Tableau Online or Tableau Server, and the data source contains their usernames, this calculation will continue to function. Thank you for watching this data security video. We invite you to continue with the other on-demand training videos to learn more about using Tableau.